Hi, I'm Chet Tucker, Executive Director of Arcadia Brands. Happy to partner with Pure Pressure today. Uh, today we're going to go over the craft of solventless edibles. Today we're going to talk about the craft of solventless edibles, an old-fashioned handcrafted way of extracting concentrate from the flower. We're not using any $100,000 machines that strip away the whole power to plant. We're going with the cleanest way possible, that is using pure pressure and the heat to extract what we need from our plants. So in solventless, uh, you're getting as much of that plant as possible. It's as organic as you can get. Um, and that's what we do here at Arcadia Brands is we use pure pressure machines to extract as organically as we can take it, decarb it, and then place it into our products. When you take an Arcadia product, you actually get an as organic edible or concentrate that you can possibly find. Other processes strip away the terpenes and the cannabinoids and some of those other benefits or uh, pieces of the plant that provide what's called an entourage effect, a full spectrum type effect. Uh, so when you process the way we do, you are getting the full power of the plant. We're an organic brand, so and, and that, that makes it a little bit trickier too, right? So everyone who's ever grown cannabis plant, they know same grower, same conditions, but that plant could be a little bit more potent than the one just 20 feet away from it. So it's very important, especially doing it organically to make sure you know the potency of your product and you dial it in that way your finished product can meet those um, requirements, those quality requirements. Yeah, so here at Arcadia we test every batch, uh, not only for any kind of pesticides or anything like that. We test for potency. We use the best flour on the market and we use a solventless extraction process to produce it. It's kind of amazing to me that when we first started here in Oklahoma, I wouldn't sell a product unless I had some kind of testing. And it was amazing that there were products flooding the market at the very beginning, no testing, none whatsoever. And it's not that testing was required, but it was required on such a limited basis. If you wanna produce a quality product, you've gotta test it. Because you can't just rely on, oh, I think I've got it. Mm -hmm. You know, you, you have to know, you have to get those results back. We take it that serious, quality, taste, potency, it's, it's, a, it's a top priority and top focus of ours and always has been since the very beginning when we first started. You know, and if it wasn't right, we didn't even put it out there on the market. We kept it, it went to waste, and we just made another batch. We wouldn't put anything out there that didn't meet our standards. Um, we've gone over and over recipes uh, to ensure that we have the potency and we're dialed in. Uh, so that a patient never misses a dose. It's important for us to ensure that every patient, every product that we make, they, they receive the full benefit of what they're purchasing. So we test uh, our products constantly. Um, we've got a, a, a gummy chef per se, uh, chief product engineer who has come in from out of state and, and is part of our family. And he is the one who helps make sure that we've got the best products in the market. Hi, I'm Ryan Cuthbertson, and I'm the Chief Product Specialist for Arcadia Brands. The secret starts with preserving as much of the whole plant and the entourage effect it produces. We understand the decarb process and the potency before mixing it into our edibles or making concentrates. Our products, our recipes, are tried and true and tested and have been around a long time. You know, and, and we can thank my cousin for that. I mean, that's where it came from. That's where that knowledge came from. He's done this. He's been in this industry a long time. He brings his medical knowledge from Massachusetts down to Oklahoma. And that's helped us tremendously. Um, we definitely wouldn't be where we're at uh, today if it wasn't for that knowledge, if it wasn't for the equipment that we have from peer pressure. Uh, if it wasn't for our quality controls to make sure we have quality bud, quality product coming in and, and making sure that the end product is top notch.